One of the problems we run into in vocabulary between archaeologists, historians, and theologians is things such as the Hittites. The Hittites of theology are taught to be pesky little people, barbaric in nature, um, small group of people. Meanwhile, the archaeologist and historian identifies them as a major mega kingdom, not a pesky small group of people, but a very significant group of people. They use the same terminology because the people who, who found the original Hittite discoveries had a slight biblical background. They hung a name or moniker on these people, and it took off and ran away. And as they explored them, they found that they were very significant in nature. And again, things such as the terminology of the Hittites that people separate because they lack the understanding of the other person's use of the vo vocabulary, the word used is different on both sides. We clarify that. We've done some interesting work in Hittology, um, and there's great clarification that comes when you understand the difference in the vocabulary. We d explain to you what a uh, historical, scientific, archaeological Hittite is, what a theological Hittite is, what the difference is, what the similarity is, and the difference will blow your mind. The similarities will, will change the world. And we share that for you at the website, SolomonSeries.com. So I encourage people to comment on the videos now, and, and uh, I leave even the call, I leave all comments up, leave them all posted because people have a right to be heard. I hope that people will at least watch two or three videos so they get really good comments.